Hello, first graders. Welcome to Learn and Share. We're doing number sentence practice using model drawing. Problem three. Jeff has 13 shirts. He kept some at home and gave the rest for laundry. If he gave nine shirts for laundry, how many did he keep at home? Explain your answer using model drawing and number sentence strategy. Do you want to try it yourself? Feel free to pause the video and try it yourself. Do you want to see how I solved it? I solved it in a step-by-step -step way. Let's see it. Model drawing. Let's take a quick recap first. We use rectangles to represent the given quantities. So we represent the given quantities. We can also represent the quantities missing and the more quantities needed. We can represent the quantities missing with a question mark. This can be used for addition, subtraction, multiplication, and even division. So let's solve the problem now. Step one, draw a model to show the main idea. So Jeff has 13 shirts. Here are Jeff's shirts and there are 13 of them. I've represented this with a rectangle. He kept some at home and gave the rest for laundry. So, this one over here represents the shirts kept at home. If he gave nine shirts for laundry, how many did he keep at home? So on the other one, we have nine shirts. And these are the shirts given for laundry. We put the number nine in there because we know how many shirts there are. We put a question mark in the other because we don't know how many there are. Step two, decide which operation fits the main idea. So which operation will we use? Of course, since the question mark is a part of the 13 shirts Jeff has, we will use subtraction. Step three, solve the number sentence. So 13 comes from here. And then nine comes from here. 13 minus nine equals four. So the question mark becomes four. So Jeff kept four shirts at home. Yay, we solved the problem. Coming up is the fun part and that is your own word problem. Here's a tip. You can use the same word problem and change the numbers and objects in blue to make a new word problem. Here's an example. I have 20 paintings. I, I framed some of them and the rest I kept in the folder. If I kept 13 paintings in the folder, how many did I get framed? So easy to make your own word problems, right? For more word problems, click the link in the description box below. Hope you like my video. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. See you. Bye.